I'm trying to move this along a little bit. So I played a couple days off camera. As you can see, Birdie is pregnant. She will be in her second trimester four hours. And then it's also Sebastian's birthday. So what I'm going to have Birdie do after she gets all this trash or whatever. Um, I don't know why I clicked back on her. We're going to go make a cake. Age up Bastion. And I want to do a baby shower because I never, I haven't done that yet. I want to see how that works and all that good stuff. So we're going to do that after we age uh, Bastion up. Let's see. Uh, sweets. Let's do a, ooh, winter cake. Let's do the blue confetti cake instead. Good lord, you went all over the freaking place. Okay, hurry up and go make this cake and all that. Um, I did do another competition before she started showing with Pokey. And we got bronze in that one. So we went down from a silver to a bronze. So I'm just like, I'm done with you. You're so annoying. So we'll try that again after. Stop getting trash. I totally thought she was coming in here to make cake. I didn't know she was going upstairs to get more freaking trash. Since right now she can't do any competitions, I think I want to get into... What else do I want to do? Maybe canning? I don't know. I'm trying to do aspects of the game that I never do. And I never can. Or like make cheese and stuff like that. Like... I never do all that, so I want to try it out. All right, let's pop some candles on this thing. And then I want you to wake up. You have to wake up. And I actually want um, Layton to help him blow out the candles. I think Birdie did it last time. Yeah, Birdie did it last time. So Birdie, don't go anywhere. Just like walk around or whatever. Go here, go there, whatever. Um, You come over here, help blow out candles, Bastion. Okay, happy birthday, Bastion. Even though we definitely just had a birthday for him, episodes ago this is going by fast but like i said i'm trying to speed through this he's so freaking cute i wonder what he's gonna look like as a child they always change their features up so much when they go from a toddler to a kid all right let's randomize this trait oh you're gonna be hot-headed that's fine that's cool you were an aggressive child so i'm okay with that i guess i'm okay with that let's do um it really doesn't matter because we're not going to we're not gonna be a child for long what's on your face do you have missing cc stuff on your face oh my gosh i was gonna wait to go into cast with him but he's looking freddy like freddy krueger right now and i can't i can't have this so let me go into cast with him right quick and then i'll come back out i mean he's not unfortunate looking he looks he's kind of cute oh uh, let's get a skin i think i like this one mm, i'll keep it on him for now i think it's the one that looks the best though so he might keep that um get you some lashes or whatever i'm pretty sure i put some moles on his face but i don't remember which ones they were let's go with these ones okay i think that looks okay um let me change your eyes to one of these i can't remember which eyes you had as a kid i think it was uh was it this one i think it was these yeah i'm pretty sure it was these ones so let's put those on and i'm gonna change his hair i don't want that on him i don't have very many uh kids hairs but i can try Okay, I lied. I have a lot of kids here. Johnny Sims coming through. Did not know I downloaded all this. I think I like this short hair on him. Something happened when I changed his hair. It changed his eyes. They're like weird underneath. There we go. Okay, it's so much better. Uh, I think I like this hair. I always give my kids like, I've been, I've been giving my kids long hair lately, and I need to stop. <laughs> I mean, this is still kind of long, but I need to try it and be different. Actually, this more messy hair is cuter. I like that. It's all disheveled. I like that. All right, let me find some clothes for him. He's not even going to be a kid long. I'm probably going to age him up like really soon. So I don't know why I'm doing all this, but here we are. All right, this is the everyday wear. Let's go to his sleepwear. I'm not sure if I want to put him in like full pajamas or like a top and bottom. I feel like full pajamas are so easy though. So I might put him in this. Yeah, I'll just put him in these full pajamas. Oh my goodness, not these little, are these sheep? That's so cute. I love that. It's like he's wearing a loaf of bread. Yeah, wear those. Um, party wear. Okay, we don't have a one piece that I like enough for him to put on for party wear. Cause I'm pretty sure that's what I'm pretty sure he's gonna be wearing this when I do the um what's that thing called? The baby shower. I mean he can wear this little jacket, that's fine. And some regular smegular pants. Screw it, let's put him in white pants. What what can go wrong? A kid in white pants. I think this is a cute shirt, so I'll put him in that and then some beans. I mean some shorts. Yeah, that's fine. And do I want him to have shoes or like slippers on? Okay, so that's his hot weather. And I think we're about to go into winter soon. So I guess I'll get him a cold weather look. Is it just me or does he look mean? Like he kind of looks like a bully. Not even gonna lie. Not too sure how I feel about that, especially going into the new LP. But we'll see how his personality develops. 
Okay, let me just go through and add his eyeballs and we're done with the makeover. Okay, so this is going to be moving a little bit fast. Um, what I'm going to do is have her hold an event, uh, baby shower, and we're going to do it here. Um, let me choose the expecting parent you. Can I do two? Okay, yeah. I'm doing this fast because Birdie, not Birdie, uh, Layton goes to work really soon and I want him to be there for the shower. So that's why I'm doing it so soon. Um, you're you're the one inviting people. Where's is this all the people you know? Dang, that sucks. I really suck. Sorry. <laughs> you know nobody. I should have gave you some friends, but I didn't. So 15 people is cool. Oh no, did you give it all my people? You stupid, stupid game. Let's do it at 10 a.m. Yeah, let's just do it real soon. Get it over with. All right, I don't know what having a baby shower will entail. So hopefully we have everything we need for all of this um we'll see also still can't figure out what's wrong with this uh picture thing i don't know why i can't i don't know why i can't put a picture in there in here it will not snap in that giant one at all is it because they're not large pictures i'm i don't know i'm so confused all right let's start this baby shower everybody get in your outfits thank you thank you very much all right um what do we have to do talk about the baby gush about new baby tell funny stories congratulate the expecting parents Okay, I mean, I don't know how I'm supposed to be in control of all that, but sure. What a wonderful idea. I would be so proud. What just happened? I don't know what just happened. Did they just talk about the baby or something? I, I don't know. But that's, uh, talk about dreams. I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing. And I hope nobody dies because it is definitely, uh, it's definitely hot outside and nobody is dressed for the occasion. Oh, gush about new baby. And then what are you doing, Bastion? You're just eating? Do you want to talk to your cousin? Where's he at? Hey, where'd Colton go? I seen him walk over here. Oh, he's near the horse. All right. Yeah, go talk to your cousin. Funny introduction. I need to give you a makeover, like ASAP. But let's focus on this. Um, Let's gush some more. I mean, that wasn't gushing, but we can pretend. And why are we all just at the beginning of the lot? Like, get on the lot. Oh, we already uh, completed this. Uh, That was fast. I mean, I don't really have anything else for you to do. Why is why was that so fast? <laughs> Let's call everyone to come uh, dance, maybe. Maybe people are hungry. I should have, um, what are you doing? Mm, come over here and grill something and then offer people to come eat. Uh, grill bison stew. Yeah, sure, go ahead, do that. Cause you're kind of hungry anyways. So I want you to kind of form a group. Oh uh, yeah, form a group with your brothers. Let's come over here and just dance. Oh, you got a present, good job. Oh, she's getting a whole bunch of baby shower gifts. Or was it just one? Whatever. And did you meet your cousin? I'm sorry, what is this? Why does, what is this? What is this romance bar? That is your grandmother and you were a child. That's a little concerning. I don't know what I should do about that. I guess I'm just gonna ignore it for now. And hey, you didn't even go meet your cousin. Where's he at? Right here. Funny introduction, go meet him. Why are you being rude? Let me watch this kid like a hawk, make sure he goes to go meet him. All right, you guys get to know each other. Uh, Let me try to pick up some of this poop because this is, that's a little ridiculous. Not you pooping as I'm picking up poop. That's rude. Birdie, um, go stop dancing together. Go um use the bathroom and then go get some food. And then I want you to come out here and talk to Elder. Uh call to meal. Call people to meal. You make some more food. Cause I don't think this is enough for everybody. Real, whatever that is. Do that. I'm trying to get some organic pictures taken because I'm just um I just don't want to do the whole the whole thing the thing where I have to like set them up for pictures like this is a good one take this gift from your mom that's so cute it'd be nice if you weren't in the background because you look a mess but I mean here we are <laughs> I like how they have the same nose because you can tell by the little hump right there but it's definitely like but their faces are so different oh that's so cute Oh, this is a good picture. There's a similar word that they say. It's like Joe Baba, but every single time I hear it, it's like Yo Mama. I'm like, dang, who y'all talking about? That worked out perfectly. Leighton has to go to work in an hour. This is almost done. This is a great time. I love that for us. What is y'all's friendship? Oh, it's pretty good. We need to invite him over. Um, maybe get a treehouse because this place is definitely big enough for it, especially because I'm gonna get rid of these thingies right here. And we can put the treehouse over here. Oh, so cute. The kids interaction is so cute. I like that. Oh my goodness. Family dynamic jokesters. Uh, yeah, Bastion and Colton could be jokesters. I love that. I love that for them. Oh, is this over with? The event is over? Reward earned. Okay. Okay, everyone's leaving. Is there anything in our household inventory? Let me check. There should be. I think we get like a crib. We unlock the crib or something. 
Oh, we unlocked a couple of things. So yeah, we have the crib and like a little baby thingy majigger. And the baby's going to go in this room. And this is actually going to go downstairs. And I'm going to turn this into a, a library, like a little office. Okay, that's all I'll put in the room for now. Um, I'll fix it up later. So Layton, I think you're about to go to work. Um, Actually, when do you go to work? Yeah, you got to go to work. <laughs> Stop dancing. Mom's sleeping. You are just down here chilling out. Yeah, how about you do your homework? Because we got school in the morning. And I don't know how long I'm going to keep him um, a child for. Unless I just like play some off camera. Because his he ages up in like 14 days. There's no way I'm going to have enough time to just play him as a regular lifespan before the new pack comes out. Uh, so I'll probably just have him be a child for a week. And then age him up and then have him be a teenager for a week and then age up to a young adult. And that should be just in time for the new pack. Okay, so you finish your homework. I might honestly, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven when the kid comes here. Should I get another pet? Like, should I get a cat or a dog? It's so much work because they're so needy, but I kind of feel like we need a pet. I don't know. I don't know. Let me put this in here. Um, dad, actually, let's work hard. And then mom, you're actually just going to go to sleep. Nope, you're taking a nap again. No, just go to sleep. I don't know why you're doing that weird stuff. You finish your homework and then do what do you have to do for this? Um, stomp playfully on a splash pad. I mean, I can just buy one and give you like have you buy a reward, but I don't think I don't think there is one for playful. Yeah, there's not one for playful, so We'll just have to have him like tell jokes or something. Maybe that'll be the goal. As soon as I get done with his aspiration, because I'm pretty sure I can do this one fast, then I can age him up. Um, where do I want to put the splash pad at? It's gonna be super random, just like it was at the other house. But let's put it near the fishing thing. Yeah, let's put it over here. This is so freaking random, but it's funny. Um, let's see if he tells, if he tells a joke to the horse, does that count? Can he become in a playful mood? um tell joke i can tell him to make a mess that might put him in a playful mood um it did not put him in a playful mood and now he just hates his surroundings clean that up <laughs> i thought it would help but it didn't um can you just splash turn on uh play in water maybe that will help it uh to activate <laughs> he has a lot of things going on he's energized he's inspired and he's feeling hot hot headed like he's angry but nothing playful I think what's going to happen, because the last time I did this, I, I'm going to have to um have him tell jokes or something and then come do the splash pad. But this definitely needs to go away. Like his energized mood needs to definitely leave. You don't have to play in the water anymore. You can go do whatever you want to do. Let's see what I want you to do now. Oh, my goodness. Didn't I just clean up all this poop? Good Lord. Oh, I also did not give you a bed, so I should definitely do that. Um, How are your needs doing? You're pretty fine, though. Let me get mom some food. You're still out here chilling with sierra that's cool i'm gonna turn this off actually i don't really care i really don't care uh can you do anything with the chickens oh you can clean this <laughs> boy yeah go ahead and uh clean clean the coop and scatter some feed nearby because he's definitely not doing it oh no not you i didn't want to go to you <laughs> just plop that on the ground i need to put a trash can over here somewhere where are you going where are you going let's follow this journey Let's see what let's see what's happening. Oh, Layton got um promoted, so he's going to be a m musician. So let's do that one. Oh, good job. I'm not that interfered with what I was doing, but what he did was he went sat down in the stupid bench back here and now he's going to go clean the coop. I don't I don't get it. That doesn't make any sense. Well, I am going to end this episode here. Um, I don't know who you're waving at, sir. That's just cover you. Thanks. Um, I'm going to end the episode here. Uh, next time we will definitely just be on the grind working on his aspiration getting that done so we can age him up and then hopefully i'll have a name for the baby whenever it comes so we'll see about that but yeah i'm going to end the episode here and i'll see you guys next time bye